this is what her find was today all for free well i won't complain about the free craigslist anymore again this is what her find was today all for free um i don't know there's my croc size 13 um and this skillet here so that's probably a 14 inch skillet and then the regular little flat pan that I use all the time for my eggs. Another small skillet. Little egg guy. And then one of these. This is probably the thing from H-E-B or Walmart or something. That, But I can't tell. I don't see any markings on it. So I'm not sure what it is. But, you know, the ceramic cast iron. And, um, yeah, I've kind of wanted to try one of them. I don't know how non-stick they are. But other than that... All we're gonna do is pop these. These aren't well. This one needs some some work, but the rest of these are just gonna go in the auto clean to get all that old uh, sticky grease off, and then we will um, season those up real well and start using them. Okay, so this one that she got free, we couldn't get the lid off. I even uh, tapped on it a little bit with a screwdriver, trying to get it in between and pry it up. But um, being cast iron, I don't want to tap on it too much, and so I just decided to. Burned some trash and stuff over here in the fire pit, and I stuck it in there for about five minutes, and it came right off. So, uh, get a probably go ahead and put it on the oven in the auto clean one day, or maybe I'll just let it burn off here. This I think came off of one of those cooker sets. Um, it's a Bayou Classic, it says, and I think that's kind of like the King cookers on those deep fryers that you get at your sports store or whatever. But uh, yeah, we'll get this one cleaned up too and uh, see how it goes. So this right here is one of the reasons you'll often hear me say there's always something to do and it seems like you never get ahead. As you start or finish one project, something else pops up and you've got to start on it. Like this, when your wife comes home and says, Look at these pans I found! So I'll just add them to the list of things to get done, but that's what keeps it fun. As always, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next video. Don't be intimidated to try or learn something new.